Hello, hello everybody, welcome back to Final Fantasy X. My name is Zayden Blaze, and would you look at this? We are ready. We are about to face sin like it's nobody's business. That motherfucking butterfly is going down. Now all we need to do is uh, rearrange. Well, we don't even need to rearrange anything. Not yet. We are doing. Maybe. Maybe I should have given, wa given Waka armor break. That's about it that I could think of. But that's fine. Alright, daddy, butterfly, daddy, butterfly, knife, have a piece of shit, looking ass, motherfucker. I'm coming for you. Yeah, I've got. Yeah. We've got this biatch. Hey, he's got a little town on his head. We are drawn to sin. Sin we must. Sin we will. Okay. One haste. Yeah, can we hit you? Yes, we can. 800 damage, yeah. Uh, okay. Oren still can't attack. Can can he throw shit at him? Is this yes? This is close enough for Oren to throw shit at. Zen. He's taking little to no damage. Great. Um, Lulu, can you do anything? For tell okay. Okay. Well, thank you for letting us see your goddamn nostrils. Okay, let's armor break Sin. And his fat nose. Hey, that's gonna hurt. Confuse? Wait, we have Confuse? God damn it. At least it's on Lulu, and she, like. She can't do shit. So I'm, like, not scared. So I'm just gonna keep hitting her in the. <laughs> Just keep hitting Sin in the face, I guess. Like here, let, let's clear Lulu's confusion. Um. Okay. Okay, nobody's confused. Hey! No opening your mouth! Unless it's to suck my dick. Um. Okay, I think I need to give everybody haste. Uh, yeah. Everybody haste. Please and thank you. Yes! We get another turn before sin. Let's go! Gotta beat him into the ground somehow. God damn it, Oren is confused. We can't have that. We need Oren. No exception. Hey! Hey, 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 hey. That's not good. Okay, let's just check how much HP you have. Seven, I only, we only got to half. We only got to half. That is not good. I repeat, that is not good. So... I mean, I, I guess just keep hitting him in the face. We don't have any multi-hits. That's a bit of a problem. Can we get another turn? No. But having all of that bonus attack really is important. Oh, nice. Okay, last cheer and now we go all out. Slicey dicey his facey. 
Bonk. 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 How much HP do you have still left? Uh, you don't have a sensor open anymore, God damn it! Okay, we only took down half of what you had last time. Shit! Oh, that's a fat crit! And no, oh God damn it! Uh, or a zombie, nobody cares. Ooh, nice! Nice 10 hit, 10, 10, 10,000 damage right there. Are you dead? Yes, he's dead! Oh, thank the lord, this is the closest I've ever gotten to actually losing this, goddamn. Usually I have attack reels, and attack reels after the armor break would literally just do like 25,000 damage on its own. Hello there, big ball of light. Oh, it's Sin. Oh, okay, he's just pulling us into his maw. He's inviting us to his crotch, actually. Oh! Where in the fuck is this? Is this the far plane actually inside of Sin? <laughs> Seymour? You're kidding me! Seymour, what the fuck? You, you could hear, that was Seymour's laugh. Dreamy Ketsif? Go fuck yourself. We don't need a Dreamy Ketsif. Damn! We must go to him. Then we will. Then we will. Good luck. Follow me! Alright. There's actually one thing we have to do. We've been through a lot, yeah? And hey, we're not finished yet. You're not. No matter what happens, I'll see this through. You'll prom great. You've proven yourself as a guardian. Maybe even as the best. <laughs> well. Oren still exists, so I doubt. But there is just one side quest we absolutely have to do and I just wanted to be able to enter sin and go in and out as I please before I, we actually start this. Come on game, don't, don't leave me with a black screen. Come on, that's not nice. Game! Hello, game! Finally. The Omega Ruins. Is this place it's quite dark 700 years ago a monk who defied the teachings was sentenced here oh the traitor omega yeah yep omega's loathing of yevon has turned him into a fiend a fiend you say. say he liked it underground out of the light so he's here scared <laughs> not a chance I would be scared, goddamn. Hell no. This is a perfect place to farm for items and shit. Like, okay, let me just change up my lineup. Um. Yeah, we can have re. That's not what I wanted. We can have. Riku, I suppose? Or something like this. Oh! It's these guys. Oh, 
fire gems, yay. There are two easy ways to beat these guys. One, bring Lulu out. She has fire eater, she can die. Oh, Lauren still can. Second, bring Waka out. He has a waiting counter, he can die. Ooh, you're just gonna steal some more. Second, bring Kamari out and equip him with that Dragoon Lance we found earlier. And, and just literally, and just literally, and just literally do this. That's that's literally just one way of completely fucking annihilating this entire battle. Like they they can't do anything to you. They try to hit Lulu. They're they're going to heal her. They can't hit Kamari or Waka, because they have evade encounter. And they can't for some reason they're not hitting Lulu either. She her evasion is just that good. And for some reason they keep hitting uh, Waka the most, even th even though he has the strongest attack. And just... you win. I, like, what can they do? There, they hit Lulu and they heal her. Like... Bitches, so what? This is like one of the easiest fights out there. Or... There's a different way you can go about this, I think. You equip Stone Strike. Pretty sure that you... Okay, so... That, that was not very smart of me. Okay. So apparently they... They can't be turned to stone. They just have a resistance to it. Because Stone Strike is just 100% chance. But if they have a resistance... Then that 100% chance is lessened to whatever the fuck it is. Now, some stuff like... Uh, whatchamacallit. So, some stuff like petrify grenades, they, they work 100% of the time unless the target is immune specifically. Ouch. That's fair. I suppose. Okay. Either way, you see where, where I'm going at it with this. Oh, this fight, okay. Uh, this fight is basically just to steal, steal petrifying grenades. That's all it is. Oh. <laughs> we, yeah, okay, we still have the... We still have the, the other thing equipped. The stone strike. Oh uh, yeah, this is just petrifying grenades. Steal as much as you want, steal as much as you can. Before killing them. Can you turn these guys to stone? Yes, you can, okay. Ouch. So again, those guys don't have to worry about them. Anybody else you need to worry about? Nope. But that chest, do not, I repeat, do not steal from it. It's bad. It's a bad, bad, bad chest. It's a mimic chest. Mimic chests are bad, okay? You you, you don't want to deal with mimic chests. Game? Come on, okay. Actually, let's customize Riku's weapon. I feel like it's time. The flexible arm will have... First strike. In... Ooh, chocobo feathers. We can't teach Anima haste if we use the initiative one here. And... Okay, let's do it. 
What else do we need? What else do we need? Stone touch, don't need it. Strength, magic, counter attack. Okay, the other stuff doesn't doesn't matter right now. Ooh, this is nice. Healing water. We want healing water. And we can turn this guy to stone as well. Like so many so many things here can be just, you know, still stoned. Even though, you know, you're like you're supposed to have gone through uh, over with that by now. But like nah, still turn stuff to stone. Okay. Taste. Okay. That 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 thing is automatic no matter what you do. Oh, he's immune. Oh, he has a light. He has a stone resistance. Yeah, but he has resistance. He's not immune, so you can still turn him to stone. Believe it or not. I don't know what you what we can use the, the farpling wind for. Okay then. Fine. God damn it. Where am I? Fuck you. So yeah, he has a resistance, but not an immunity to being turned to stone. Which is the case for most fiends here. Like, they might have resistances, but they're never immune. Never, ever, ever immune. Yeah, preemptive strike. Cool. Stamina tab too, that's nice. Let's armor break you, because you have armor. More healing was stamp. God damn it. Ah, this guy has a resistance as well. We last time we just got lucky. Hello Lulu. What weapon do you have anyway? Magic plus ten. Dark strike sleep strike. Interesting. Let's just cast fire, because we can. Oh, it heals them. Great. And we just... Nope, no stealing. Can't turn him to stone either. Lulu. Beat his ass. Ugh. Fine. We'll use a petrifying grenade. Fine. Okay, the stone strike is not working right now. But anyway, this place is great for farming. It gives you so much XP. So much XP. You won't even know what to do with it anymore. And uh, the reason why I'm sticking close to the safe sphere is because... This is the only safe sphere here. There is no other one. So you have to go from here all, all, all the way to Omega and kill him. So like, obviously you want to train up a bit before that, right? You don't, you don't want to just go willy nilly in there. Hey. Okay, there's an there's one way to beat this. And it's very retarded. Just like with Defender X, the boss battle at Mangaga Z, you can provoke this motherfucker. And that's it. You're safe for life. You 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 are safe for life. Like they can't do shit to you. Also, let's change Walker's weapon. Don't want Stone Cold no more. He just heals us! Motherfucker just heals us until the end of time. So now you so now you can literally just as long as Titus is on the field, you can continue trying to steal, you can continue trying to do whatever the fuck you want. Flare doesn't matter. Like, you're just gonna get healed. 
Hi, Porsche. Okay. Also, there's one place I didn't cover so far. Because I was too lazy, basically. But I probably should cover it. Uh, it's uh, the temple at Calmlands. You'll specifically need to train a chocobo to get there. So... So that's kind of the trick with that place. You, you, you literally need... You need to train a chocobo, you need to get up there. And then you need to do a chocobo race to win. So that's why I didn't really try. I was just too lazy. No, okay. Wait, well, don't attack him. He's our saving grace. Oh yeah, also, the white wind that removes berserk. So like, hooray. And there, Seal doesn't have Berserk anymore. Oh, come on. Really? You actually fucking killed him. Uh, he actually fucking killed him. Okay, then. Oren. Okay, let, let's, let's goddamn finish this battle. No, no, not Kimari. Kimari, your weakest F. Lizard? What? Oh yeah, because provoke. It it ended because you know, he died. White when yeah, great, awesome, great, awesome, great. Okay, let's do finish this one battle and goddamn. End this video. Armor break. The elemental. Bonk. And now we can finish this guy off while he continually heals us. He's such a good friend. Okay guys, I think, I'm sh I think I've shown pretty much how to deal with most of the encounters here so far. But... How in the fuck did we get into another encounter? Oh boy. This is bad. Uh, oh, oh, f thank fuck. Thank fuck. Actually, this is the one encounter I was, af I was actually afraid of because Titus doesn't have first strike weapon. And this guy, this motherfucking Mulboro, he will always ambush you, no matter what. I don't know if it goes through initiative weapons, but it's so fucking annoying. And as you can see, he just uses Bad Breath instantly, and look at what it did. Poison, Darkness, Silence, Confuse on everybody. Thankfully, Oren got out of it. So we can switch to Riku. Riku can then use a Remedy. Actually, what the fuck? Riku has so many turns. What the fuck? Okay, well, let's use some of those turns to steal some Remedies. Because we're gonna use them. On Titus. And Titus is going to get us the fuck out of here! Yeah, that, that's the only encounter I was afraid of. So, with that being said, I will leave this episode here. And we will continue off until we defeat Omega in the next one. Peace!